Yo, what is going on guys? We're back today for another Cosmic Ghost Rider video. Today, we're gonna be using the six star Cosmic Ghost Rider in Act 6 in the final quest, the Grand Master Quest. We're gonna be running through a path and we're gonna be boosting, but no champion boost or anything. We're only gonna be using a Cosmic Boost to basically allow us to cycle our special attacks. Now, the reason why I wanted to show this is because I think this will be, this is a very common practice in Alliance War with a Ghost, Corvus, and I think it'll be a very common practice with Cosmic Ghost Rider. I think he has phenomenal potential in Alliance War. So I just kind of wanted to test this for myself, and it went pretty well, so I wanted to show you guys. And also, uh, this is killing two birds with one stone. This is the path to the Grand Master. So if you guys want to see what happens after I complete the path, you know, drop a like on the video, and uh, we'll get that uploaded too. So here, we're going to th throw on a boost, so a 200% Cosmic Boost. And I think I'm going to throw on a... I want to increase my attack uh, on my special attacks by uh, 12 percent as well so uh, yeah we're going to jump in here and the first fight is a uh, psylocke here so this uh this also has masochism these health pools are fairly big 240,000 ish so the average alliance war fight is not that much but mini bosses are around there and the boss is is higher than that so just to factor that in so you know if you were fighting an alliance, and in alliance war, you also use actual boosts, like attack boosts, so that would also uh, increase using these power boosts. Because how these power boosts work is they don't really work in places like Abyss and Labyrinth of Legends, uh, but they work could because how they work is the damage that you get back is based on the like percentage of health that your special basically takes away from your opponent. So you know, in Abyss and like Labyrinth, you know, your special might hit for 200k. But like that's only doing a small percentage of their health, so you don't get that much back. But in alliance format, <laughs> these boosts are are insane. Um, and yeah, as you can see with this Psylocke here, <laughs> our uh, <laughs> we used a special two, it got us up like to another special two. We dropped a special three. After that, we added a special two. Like is is ridiculous, man. And like we we weren't even playing that good right there. Uh, we didn't even have like the. We weren't even like close to being fully set up either and like that's why i think cosmic ghost rider is like so good because yeah he's he's absolutely insane fully set up but you don't even need to get him fully set up man so you'll see on these fights here um i i uh, don't even really worry about the fury you know i start and uh i just i get the the uh, uh precision and cruelty that's what i try for here i accidentally got the uh, precision and this doc this Doc Ock fight's also kind of annoying because uh, with those with those boosts, if I get too much power, he's going to uh, he's going to actually power lock me, <laughs> which is super annoying. And also the masochism, it uh, if, if I time it wrong, I do it a couple times. Uh, it'll it'll take off my damnation debuff, and then I won't get my armor breaks applied, and that'll basically just strip uh, all those judgments, and then I can start over. But you know the good thing about starting a new judgment cycle is the five armor breaks. So yeah, I don't want to mistime that. But here you see, I got the uh, the power lock uh, debuff from Doc Ock. Cause the the power boost gave me too much power. But here we got the fury. So now we're gonna activate the uh, the cruelty. Uh, sorry, the precision and the cruelty, and it's gonna hit uh, pretty hard. Uh, we get power locked again. So unfortunately, we don't get to another special two. We we would have totally gotten to another special two if uh, if we weren't fighting a Doc Ock that that power locked us. But you know. It, Still went okay. Uh, you can you can see the basically what what those boosts can do, and uh, we got we got a bunch of uh, villains, uh, tech villains, to which tech is good. But it so against these fights, we you know we we start uh, in applying an armor break because they're villains, but they shrug it off because of the masochism. That's why the masochism is triggering at the start, and that's why these villains aren't being uh, armor broken. Uh, I, I guess it doesn't try to reapply itself, uh, so that's interesting. So here we're gonna drop the special two, uh, and you can see it, it just hits like an absolute truck. Brings us to a special three. We drop this special three, and this might just kill him, dude. Like we got a bunch of armor breaks on him right now, and uh, this this special three is gonna give us a fury. This fury is gonna last for 45 seconds, but we don't need it. Mysterio's dead. <laughs> like. It's it's crazy, man. Using one of these boosts in Alliance War with Cosmic Ghost Rider, it's, it's gonna be such a good, such a good synergy. Um, it's it's pretty crazy, man. It's pretty crazy. You can see, like, I'm not even like getting that set up, and we're just ripping through these 250k health opponents. And uh, this is a six star rank three. 
but this isn't with any kind of additional like attack or health boost or anything like that. And in Alliance War, you know, you could easily get a 565 up to the damage output that, I'm, that my, my rank 3 is doing here uh, just by using some attack boost like, easily. So this damage is totally, totally possible. Uh, here I accidentally get pushed to an L3. I was trying to get out my special 2 there, but I was also trying not to dex, uh, which is just kind of unfortunate. That's just the way it goes sometimes. Uh, and here I think I made the mistake of not triggering Masochism first. So I think she's going to shrug off the damnation here. Was this when I messed it up? Oh, no, no, I had it there. Okay, I, I know I messed it up at some point. There's just there's a lot going on when you're playing Cosmic Ghost Rider. He's there's a lot going on when you're playing him, and then additional nodes and stuff as well. So it gets pretty crazy. But uh, as you see right there, we get to that special two, and it just rips her apart. And and if she wasn't dead, we just drop the L3, and then if the L3 doesn't kill her, the Cosmic Boost will just give us more power towards our next special. We just get to that next power threshold quicker, because with Cosmic Ghost Rider, it's all about those special attacks. Uh, it's all about those special attacks, and that's why using his power gain is so important and like um, critical to his cycle, and that's what takes some skill with playing him and some some thought. So just having so much additional power gain through a boost like that, dude, it's, uh, it makes him more forgiving to play and just so much more insane. Uh, so yeah, here we're just going to totally block this. I'm uh, going to parry what we can, and uh, yeah, try not to dex uh, against this guy. Get the power gain because Green Goblin actually lowers uh, your power rate. It's just one of his abilities, which is pretty annoying. So here we're going to drop this special 2. And it doesn't give us that much power back. And that's mainly because of Green Goblin's ability there. Uh, but you can see we're hitting like an absolute truck. And we just get to another special 2. And it, <laughs> he rinses him. And if that didn't kill him, we would have been at another special 2. And the great thing about the special 2s is they keep applying armor breaks and those armor breaks keep on stacking so you can just l2 armor breaks l2 armor breaks and your l2s are going to keep and i'm just going to hit harder so it's ah it, it's 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 great man it's, it's really great ah, the, these these power boosts with with certain characters are just so ridiculous man like with ghost and corvus they're so insane and now cosmic ghost rider joins the rank of that insanity uh so here we got a puncher 2099 slipped up Took a, took a hit there, he triggered the armor uh, judgment, but that's all right. I'm gonna drop a special two here, and it's gonna give me uh, almost a special three, but I just enough for another special two, and uh, <laughs> rinsed him. And then again, it, if that wasn't enough, we, we still got the special three. It's just, it's, it's blowing my mind how good this actually was working, man. Uh, next up, we had a couple of mystic fights, which honestly didn't go very well, um, and you know, the that's the only negative to these boosts. Well, there's a couple of negatives. The L1 doesn't count towards them, uh, but it also doesn't work against the uh, normal class disadvantage. So with a cosmic one, it doesn't work against mystic champions. Fun fact though, it does work when you have class disadvantage. Uh, if it's like a, a, a node that like uh, flips class advantage and disadvantage, or if it's the universal class like maestro collector, uh, these boosts still work against uh, that those kind of champions. It's only like the actual on the six class wheel disadvantage that it won't work against. So uh, here we get to the final fight on this uh, path here. So Warlock, this is like the big bad mini boss. He's uh, had a lot more health than the other characters, and he's kind of a pain to fight, uh, especially with his nodes and just how how beefy he is. So uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider, we're gonna have to really lay into him. And uh, here, so you can see, we got uh, the damnation on him there, and that uh, prevented him from going to three bars of power after my special three. Unfortunately, I didn't time it right, uh, so the ma when the, the masochism actually took off my armor breaks from the judgment, which is kind of annoying, but that's okay. Uh, we got the fury, so we're gonna let uh, this special two loose. It's gonna armor break him, so now we'll get some crits, uh, and boom, push us back to another special two, which is great. And I don't even have the uh, Judgment of Precision, but as you can see, we don't even need it, man. We don't even need it. Um, and that's the final fight on that path, just rinsed by Cosmic Ghost Rider. So, he just absolutely tore through one of the, the final quest in Act 6, that lane. That lane's fairly difficult, um, and he just he walked through it, man, like, no problem. So... Yeah, I think Cosmic Ghost Rider with those boosts are pretty insane. I can't wait to get this guy and to use him in a war and to really show 
this in war matchups and against like war bosses and stuff uh i think it'll be pretty darn good uh but yeah that's gonna do it for this video if you guys enjoyed drop a like um and yeah let me know if you guys want to see the grandmaster fight thank you guys so much for watching peace out